I can't believe it, the water's all gone. I need to add a wall or something. Because the most important thing in water parks is safety and nothing else. That's the number one thing a water park owner should be concerned about. Now it's time to test out this slide. It looks really crazy and wow. Yeah, it's really cool. Hello, dear friends. This is Peppa and George. Yes, hello, dear friends. We are very happy to see you today. And we have even prepared an activity, Peppa. Tell the kids about it. Yeah, guys, the thing is, George and I have decided to have a competition. Today we're going to see who's more skilled at building water parks. I think we'll make some slides and see who has the most creative and fun water park. And we even built a huge wall here so that no one would peek at each other and everything would be fair. So we need to start making some extreme very high slides right away so that Peppa doesn't even dare to climb them. I really like it when they make really scary slides in parks and it's always fun to ride them. It's a very different experience. So that's the most important thing in the attraction, but I think the most important thing is to have a lot of slopes and to have a very steep slope in general for the slide. You also have to be sure to make it very high. Don't forget. So, well, I think I have the first lift ready. I need to add a little bit of water here, bamboo. It looks very nice, especially in combination with this wool. I don't think the water will hurt the wool, of course, but it will definitely be soft for people to be on. My first slide won't really be very big. I want it to be mostly for the kids to ride and not really scary, but the second slide will definitely surprise everyone. I wonder what kind of slides George is getting now. Did he try hard? It's going to be very high, just unbelievably high. No one will probably even be able to get on it. At least Peppa won't go up there. She'll say it's too extreme and she's not ready for that. She probably does some kind of children's slide, which is not scary at all, and it is not needed in such water parks. I think that all water parks should have very scary slides, and only the other slides make no sense at all. Great, almost finished the first slide. So now we will complete the curbs here, and I think we can pour water and try this slide. I think the children will really like to make a little pool at the bottom, but then we need to check how far the water will flow here first. So we should probably add some more blocks on the side here, just to be on the safe side, otherwise I think the water might spread. They don't want anyone to get hurt and fall out of bounds somehow. It would have a very negative impact on my water park's reputation. Oh, no, I can't believe it. The water's all gone. I need to add a wall or something so it doesn't flow anymore. So it seems like on one side it was getting and on the other side it wasn't. And I realized that because I have some holes at the bottom here and the water flows through them. Okay, well, I think I've got a great slide. I just need to add some space at the top to get in here. So I'll add these logs here. I think the water stopped here, and that's it. Okay, but now we're doing level two of my slide. It will be the scariest, and only the bravest guys will be able to climb up and down it. I don't think George will always climb up, but he needs to appreciate my water park, so he has to do it. We need to make some kind of a good passageway in here so no one bumps their head or falls out accidentally. Because the most important thing in water parks is safety and nothing else. That's the number one thing a water park owner should be concerned about. So for slide two, I'm going to call it the very tall tower of fear. I did not decide to call it so because it is really very scary. And it is most importantly, high. And from it, people will take a very long time to roll down. I think such a height will definitely scare anyone and not everyone will dare to climb this slide. We'll leave it to the brave one. It's probably not gonna be Peppa. Okay, but I think it's just high enough for everyone to be scared, so I want someone to at least try this slide. It's so high, it takes my breath away, and I can just imagine what it's going to be like when we add water. Yeah, I don't think George is going to build a slide like this. I wonder, he probably built the whole thing out of dirt and improvised materials again. Why does he already have access to any resources? Why is it that he what can't build really that good? I just can't believe this means it's time for us to start instilling good taste in George. So, Peppa, 
I'd like you to finally see my water park project. These are the two slides that are in it. They are very high, and I understand if you don't want to ride them and you would be scared, but I still recommend you to try. At least this first one is not the scariest and not the most extreme one there is, but it still makes you nervous. Be careful. The main thing is not to fall down, or this one didn't think about safety, you can fall down. But overall, if you jump in, you'll be fine. That's how cool it is, my slide. The data is really interesting, but I think you should replace the material it's made of. All right, let's check out your second slide. We need to get in here and see what's in here. I see you've already put some protection in here, but just a little farther than you need, so let's try it. Well, that's a pretty fun slide, George, if it wasn't so slow. But all in all, you've got a really great water park. I think if you work on it a little more, your ideas are great. So, Pippa, let's take a look at your water park. Wow, you've got some really great slides here. Let me try the first one, which I assume is the kitty slide, right? So let me jump down here and see if it's really quite fun. But I'm interested to see the highest extreme slide above it. I think you've tried a lot harder. Wow, you are down here and have thought of protection everywhere. I can't even fall out of here. I want to give you special praise for that. Now it's time to test out this slide. It looks really crazy and wow, yeah, it's really cool. And the most important thing is that it is safe. No one can hurt themselves on this slide and everyone will have a lot of fun in my water park. Anyway, these are the two slides I have made. I hope that you and the audience liked them and you will appreciate my water park. I tried very hard and put all my efforts into building it the way it turned out. So guys, here we are finished building our water parks. Write in the comments which one did you like best? I really hope it's mine because I think I tried harder on it than Pepper and without deserved a lot of likes for it from you. Look at how beautiful he is. Okay George, I think each of the guys will decide for themselves who had the better water park and they will vote for themselves in the comments for the best slide from this video. Like, like, subscribe to the channel. See you all later. In this video, family, why is my house collapsing? Leaves fall out. Did I do something wrong? I don't like it. Peppa, you probably started it wrong. And now all the leaves will fall out. You need to find a new place to build a house. <laughs> Hello, our dear subscribers. Today we continue to play Minecraft. In the last episode, we did not have time to finish our houses. In this episode, we will definitely have time to finish them. I promise you. Hi, hi are our favorite subscribers. In this series, you will see how we will build our houses. In the last series, we prepared everything for it. Dug up resources, got food. Hello to our favorite subscribers. We will build our houses. Do not forget to write in the comments who got the best. Let's not turn this into a competition, just an amateur argument. Okay, George, what do you think about that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, family, let's go into our world and then we'll decide what to do next. Everyone ready for our crazy trip? I have no patience for your answer. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Family, I have already appeared. I have already started building my house. It will be so unusual. I'm going to build it in the ground. You will just be surprised how beautiful and interesting it will be. Peppa, what's so interesting you're going to build? You said you were going to build something in the ground. You can tell me more about that. George and I are very interested. Isn't that George? <laughs> Mom, George, thank you for wondering what I'm going to build. I found a fallen tree and I'm going to build my house in it. That is my house will be hidden in leaves. It is so interesting. And what will you build? Well, as I said in the last series, my house will be completely of glass. It will not be very big, but very beautiful. I'm building such a house for the first time, but I think it will turn out very interesting and crazy. Well, see, George, Daddy Pig, and what are you going to build? I have unfortunately not yet found a place for my house, but I will build it in some rock. This is a very modern house. It is very comfortable. You can immediately dig up useful resources without leaving home. I think my idea is very interesting. George, what are you going to build? <laughs> Family, why is my house collapsing? Leaves fall out. Did I do something wrong? I don't like it. 
Peppa, you probably started it wrong, and now all the leaves will fall out. You need to find a new place to build a house. <laughs> George, stop laughing. It's not funny. Okay, then I'm gonna take all my accumulated resources and go build a house somewhere else. Too bad I can't build a house here. It's very sad. I don't even know what to do. Peppa, I wish you could build a house in the place you've chosen. You'll have to spend more time building a house. Well, I'm sure the audience will appreciate it. I think they'll vote for you. By the way, what are your plans for building a new house? Dad, I'm going to build a tree house. Right now, I'm making a ladder so I can get into my house. I think it's good that I had to build a house in a new place because the treehouse looks pretty and better. Wow! The treehouse is quite an interesting building. I think you'll make it this time. I think you will be voted for in the comments because two times to build a house is very difficult. All right, let's daughter. You will succeed. Yes, Peppa. Dad is really right. You are a good man. I'm sure not everyone will manage to build two houses at once, but you and George are the best and brightest kids ever. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. You are the best parents in the world. I love you very much. I'm so glad I have parents who will always support me. Thank you for being... <laughs> Let's talk a little bit about the weather. Do you like today's weather? Can we go a little walk after the Minecraft? Because if I'm being honest, I have a headache sitting on my computer. Peppa, this is a very good idea. I like it. But what do George and Mom think about it? If they don't mind, we can actually go out. Family, listen, I don't mind. I even think it's a very good idea. I'm four, only here's where we go. I suggest you go for a walk in the park. There is very fresh air and we will not be bored. Mama Pigs, this is a pretty good idea. I'm all for. I think it's a pretty good idea. Today is pretty wonderful weather for a walk. There is not a single cloud outside. That is, it will not rain and we can walk in our favorite park. Thank you, Peppa. I'm very glad you and George liked my idea. I hope during the walk we will have a very fun time. Have some of our favorite ice cream. George, just the way you like it. <laughs> Well, family, let's discuss our houses better. Maybe someone's home is ready, or maybe almost ready. Here's my house at the construction stage. Mama Pig, how are things with your house? Peppa, thank you for asking. I have already started building my house. Only I will probably build it for a long time, because it is made of glass, and the glass still need to melt. So it will take quite a bit of time. All right, and how is our beloved dad pigs? Mama Pig, thank you for asking. My house is almost ready. It remains to dig out a little territory and put the chests in bed. My house is already in the final stage of construction. It is just a little bit more and I will finish it. George, and how are things with your house? Did you remember to build it? I hope that means you've built it or are building it. It's just that if you haven't started building it, you've lost. But I'm sure you built it. You'll get the most beautiful one. You and the Peppa will win. Thanks, Mom. You're so thoughtful. George and I love you so much. You are the best mom ever. Thank you for being there. By the way, my house is almost ready. Now it is only necessary to find wool for the bed and you have finished your house. <sighs> Peppa, I've almost finished my house. Now I just have to wait until the glass for the roof is finished and mine will be ready. How is it going with Daddy's piggy house? Have you finished it yet? Mama Pig, we haven't talked about this for a long time. My house is almost ready too. Mom, better tell me how you feel. Maybe you don't like something in your house. Maybe you wanted to build another house. Peppa... How did you know I really wanted to build another house in the first place? I wanted to build a house in the rock at first, just like Papa Pig did. But I decided not to build a house like his, because that wouldn't be fair. I had to build a house out of glass, but I don't regret it because it turns out quite beautiful. <laughs> wow, Mom, that's pretty decent. 
I probably would have done the same thing in my place if George had wanted to build the house I wanted. Of course I would have let him. We're a family. And I can think of another idea. I'm not a little girl. Thank you, Peppa. I'm proud of you too that you understand my act and would do the same. You are quite clever for your age. Alright family, let's start saying goodbye to subscribers. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked this video. If you want to see more videos in this format, do not forget to put likes. Good luck. Subscribers, thank you very much for watching this video to the end. We really like it when you watch our videos. Do not forget, please write in the comments whose house you consider the most beautiful and interesting. Thank you all for watching. Bye bye. Yes, Daddy Pig, you're right. Thank you all for watching this video. Don't forget to please subscribe to us. We are glad that you are becoming more and more. We love every subscriber. Oh, bye. <laughs> In this video, parents, what are you gonna do? I want stone tools and already with the help of digging resources to build your house, it will be quite unusual, you will be surprised. <laughs>
Peppa, thank you for asking. I'm going to dig sand, melt sand to get glass. From glass, I will build my wonderful house. What is George going to do? Maybe he also wants to build a house for himself? <laughs> Wonderful! Let's build ourselves houses and the audience will appreciate who turned out the most beautiful and unusual house. I'm sure I'll win this time because I'm building myself a house in leaves. Like in real life. Something like a hut. Peppa, this is just great. We believe that you will have the most beautiful house. Mom and I are pig very happy for you. George, you too keep up. You must build a decent house to fight the Peppa. Okay, kids, just don't do this in a competition. We're just building houses to live in. Peppa! Daddy Piggy said it right. You don't have to turn it into a competition. You can fight and we don't have to fight. We're family. All right, kids, build. You have to surprise our viewers. Mom, Dad, how could you think that George and I would fight? We're family. We have to stick together. I would never quarrel with my brother over any game. That's absurd. How could you think that of me and George? George, what do you think? <laughs> it's a good thing George is taking this as a joke. I think he'd resent you if he was a little older. Let's change the subject. Better tell me how you're doing in building your houses. Well, I'm actually getting my own food now. And the place of the house I have not yet decided. I want to find some rock and live in it. I think it's pretty fun. Mom Pigs, what do you want to do? I have put the sand on the melting. Now I will build a house for myself after the sand comes up. I think this house will look quite interesting because none of us has ever built a whole house out of glass. <laughs> wow, Mom, this is a pretty interesting house. I think our viewers will definitely like it. Maybe they will like my house too. It will be quite small and the entrance will be quite strange. All right? Peppa, it's all right. You'll still have the most beautiful and interesting house. I don't doubt you. Come on, kids. Tell me something interesting. Maybe something happened recently? Mom, it seems like it's not bad. It's Friday. School week is over. I'm very excited. By the way, I forgot to tell you that I corrected my bad grades at school. I tried very hard to fix them. I succeeded. George, how are you? <laughs> Kids, this is all pretty good. I'm really happy for you, Peppa, that you corrected the grades at school. For this, we will go biking tonight. Family walk, I think, will be pretty fun. We can talk. We can talk about George's behavior. I won't forget either. George, why are you so upset? Dad was joking, right, Dad? Of course I was joking. I won't spoil our fun family outing. I understand everything. But George, you still have to correct your behavior. I really hope you think about it and make it right, but I'm not going to scold you. Haha, <laughs> Daddy, you're so good. He's scared. Why did you scare him, all right? It's a good thing he's funny again because I wouldn't want to go out with him when he's not in the mood. Ahaha, <laughs> this is all really quite fun. All right, family, let's finish. Let's finish our houses in the next episode. I think the audience will not be offended and will be happy. Thank you all for watching. Remember to like. Thank you for watching, dear subscribers. We are very glad that you like our videos. We are very happy when you subscribe to us. So don't forget to check the subscription to our channel. All bye. Subscribers, the video unfortunately ends. I am very sorry to admit it because I would like to play more. Anyway, we will meet soon anyway. Soon you will see on our channel a new series with continuation. There we will finish our houses. Don't forget to write in the comments if you want the series to come out as soon as possible. Good luck! <laughs> Hello everyone, today I will play the wonderful game of Minecraft with my family. Hello, oh the wonderful world of Minecraft. Every time I come in it's like the first time. Very interesting game. Hey kids, we're here to play again. It's a beautiful day when we play Minecraft. <laughs> If everyone wants to play so badly, let's get started. All right, let's get started. Oh yeah, here we go. So first we need to create a server. Game mode survival. 
Difficulty normal, we do not need a hard difficulty. We are not playing in Minecraft to fight endlessly with a huge number of monsters. Peppa, we've played so much Minecraft already, we have a lot of experience. Let's play on hard next time. Daddy, you're right. We're already good at a lot of things, and together we're strong. All right. Next time we play hard difficulty. I came into the world, you're here? I'm already here. I'm looking around. Oops. Of course I'm already on the server. I'm about to get my first tree. <laughs> Dolphin, let's talk about something. How do we spend today after Minecraft? I think we can go for a walk in the park today. It's such a beautiful day outside. That sounds wonderful. How about we gather around the table and have a family breakfast first before the walk? Oh yes! I love our family breakfasts. Let's make scrambled eggs with bacon and fresh fruit. <laughs> Sounds like a great plan. Also, let's do yoga together after breakfast. It will help us be more relaxed and ready for the adventures of everyday life. Yoga is a great idea, honey. Let's start with some simple stretching exercises. I'm sure Peppa and George will get into them too. I'm already looking forward to doing yoga. And after that, we can go to the park and ride the swings and roll down the slide. That's right, Peppa, let's have fun. Besides that, we have a few other things to do in town today. After the park, we can go to the supermarket to buy groceries and visit the children's toy store. Yay! I got a new watering can. And I'll be able to water the flowers myself. I'm so happy we have so many fun things to do. Minecraft, a walk in the park, it's so exciting. And we're happy to share these moments with you, Peppa. I love you so much. We love you and George too. You are our precious family. <laughs> I have stone tools coming soon already. How are you all doing? Oh, I'm doing great. I made myself a pickaxe and now I'll be mining stone too. We're all at the same stage. That's great. <laughs> uh-huh. Stone pickaxe. Now I need an axe to chop wood faster, a hoe to grow something, and a shovel to dig fast. Daddy, I have a question. Why do you have so many tools in the garage? Well, Peppa, tools are very useful. You can do a lot of things with them. For example, I use a hammer to beat nails into wood. And I love sawing wood. I use the saw to create different shapes and products. Wow, so you know how to make furniture? Yes, Peppa. We even made a closet for your room with all those tools. Sounds interesting. What else can you do with tools? You can use a screwdriver to tighten nuts and bolts. And there are also brushes and paints to draw and color different objects. And I like to play music. What instruments do we have for that? We have flute, guitar, and even drums. We can make a real orchestra together. <laughs> yes, Peppa. Tools help you have fun and create new things. They are very useful and fun. Great! Let's play a concert together sometime with a variety of instruments. Peppa, is everything okay? What's wrong? It's okay. I'm not hurt. The creeper came right up behind me. It exploded and I don't know how, but I didn't take much damage. Be careful, Peppa. Creepers are just waiting for you to relax. You can't close your eyes for a second. I'll be careful now. He really scared me. Oh, my baby. Scared of the creeper. Let me walk with you. I'm not feeling comfortable with you getting into this situation again. It's fine, mommy. I'll be fine. It's good that you're confident. But as soon as it's dangerous, call us. We'll be there in a second. All right. Thanks, Daddy. What do you want to do now? I don't know. I like to just walk around and explore the colorful landscape of Minecraft. It's all so beautiful. Trees, flowers, huge mountains. I wish I could find some lovely biomes. You know, I found one here. Jungle biome. There's a lot of tall trees. Wow, I found a couple pandas. They're massive. Did you know that pandas are the oldest bears on the planet? Whoa, is that true? I didn't know. The big panda is an ancient member of the bear family and may even be the ancestor of modern bears. Wow! <laughs> oh, bears are very interesting creatures. They are so big and strong. Indeed, bears are some of the most powerful animals. They can run very fast and have huge strength. I've heard that bears have very good hearing and sense of smell. They can find food many kilometers away. Wow, there are so many different residents here. Now I got a cute parrot. He's so colorful and beautiful. Birdie, I like those a lot. It's so entertaining to listen to them. Sometimes they can repeat human speech. They're so smart. Peppa, I'm sorry to say that, but really they're just repeating what they hear. They don't know how to have a meaningful dialogue, but it's true. For their size, some parrots can be very intelligent. They can easily solve puzzles for small children. Thanks, Daddy. It's always interesting to learn more about animals and the world around us. I'm happy to tell you everything I know. <laughs> I'm thinking of making myself a little vegetable garden. Is that a good idea? 
Your own vegetable garden. Hmm. You'll have food. Isn't that wonderful? That's all great, of course. But it's going to take a long time to grow. You could starve to death 100 times over. If you plant a lot of seeds, and it would be great if you have bone meal to increase growth, then it makes sense. Thanks, Daddy. I'll plant a lot of seeds then. I have some food I can wait for them to grow. In the jungle, I found watermelons. Wow, I don't have any food. How lucky I am. I'm so hungry. Good for you, Peppa. There are lots of watermelons in the jungle. Look hard. You'll find a huge pile of watermelons. George, are you okay? <laughs> George seems to be doing fine. I'm glad. Have you built your houses yet? I'm not quite ready for a house. Yeah, I think it's time to build. But I've got a lot more wood to get. I agree. Let's build different houses and see how we do. Maybe we'll all have the same house that looks like a box. Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! That's probably what's going to happen. Not that I know how to build houses. I'll try, but I can't promise anything. <laughs> Let's talk about our favorite houses. I think my favorite house is our pig house. We have so much fun here. Oh, of course, dear. Our house is very cozy and warm. I love its spacious living room where we can spend time together and play our favorite games. Yes, and I love our house too. I especially love our beautiful kitchen where I cook delicious meals for our family. And we all know how much I love to cook. I also love our room. I have so many toys and books in there. Sometimes I even invite my friends over to play. Yes, your room is really wonderful. But let's not forget about our garden. We spend so much time there gardening and playing outdoors with the kids. And of course, we cannot forget about our cozy veranda. There we can relax and enjoy a cup of tea while admiring our wonderful garden. I think we have the best house ever. <laughs> Absolutely right, dear. We are very happy to have such a wonderful home where we can create beautiful memories together playing Minecraft. Ouch! What's wrong, honey? Nothing. It's just a walking creeper exploded in the water near my house. Is everything okay with the house? It's fine. I'll finish it. I built my house. How are you doing? I'm finishing up with mine. It's done. I'm ready. George, you good? <laughs> oh, that's great. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe and like. And don't forget to comment what kind of video you would like to see. Bye, everybody. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. We had a great time. Thank you, kids, for watching. Bye, everyone. Hi, everyone. Today we're going to play a game of Minecraft. Family, are you ready? Hey, hey, of course I am. Every time I dive into this wonderful world, it brings a lot of joy. Hello, my lovelies. We all really enjoy playing Minecraft. Let's get started. <laughs> That's great. I'm going to create a world for us. World name is Peppa and game mode survival. We have already played hardcore. Today we will take a little break from this atmosphere. Creating. I created the world. You can come in now. I'm in. Wow, not a bad spawn to start with. Right away I see a tree and a mountain where I can mine my first stone. Nice. I'm here. My spawn is great too. There are lots of trees, several biomes. Let's start our survival. And I need some wood to start with, of course. <laughs> so I made myself a crafting table. Now I'm going to make a wooden pickaxe to get my first stone. What are your plans for this world, family? Enjoying the world, of course. But seriously, I'll do the usual. Traveling the world and creating my own buildings. That's what Minecraft is all about. Well said, Daddy. <laughs> uh-huh, I see. I found some huge mushrooms in this world. We've seen these before. But now I can see them properly. They're really big. Wow. Really? I take it this is very rare in Minecraft. We've only seen them once. Even though we've been playing a lot. I wonder how many hours we've been playing Minecraft. I think over 24 hours, maybe more. The very first time we played, we managed to defeat a dragon. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> time flies by in Minecraft. I wouldn't be surprised if we've already played for over 100 hours. I'll have to find the stats somewhere. I've seen that statistic somewhere, but I forget where. Well, it doesn't matter. I made myself some stone tools and now I'm going to walk around a bit to see what's interesting. I dug a little bit of earth under me and found coal right away. What luck! This survival will be special. Nice! How many diamonds you can miss just walking around the mine, but they are always somewhere under your feet. You just need to dig a little bit under yourself. The idea is interesting, and it is true that there are so many resources under our feet, but we do not see them. 
What we do see is what I just found, a broken portal with a chest. In it, I found myself a gold armor and a lot of other stuff. I just don't understand why I need it. Maybe for alchemy. Yes, there are various things of gold in those chests, and some of them can only be found in hell. I'm currently harvesting mushrooms to make a delicious soup out of them, by the way. It's a perfect way for sustenance. You've had great luck with the spawn. Finding food immediately is one of the first rules for successful survival. Finding mushrooms or a village with plants makes life a lot easier. Wow, after coal, now I've mined iron. Minecraft just wants us to keep playing this wonderful game. Find iron like that. I'd be jumping for joy. Well done, mummy. Ouch! I found those mushrooms too, but I'm not interested in them yet. I have a full hunger scale. I think now is the time to get as much wood as possible for my first house. I think I should get some wood too, but for now, I want to make lots of soup to eat. To do that, I need to harvest another big mushroom and I'll have enough mushrooms for that. <laughs> Peppa, you and George are in the same room, aren't you? Can you tell me what he's doing? I'm very interested to know what George is working on. <laughs> I looked it up. George wants to build himself a house out of stone. But that would take a lot of stone, so he's mining a lot of it now. We'll see what he's got. Oh wow, that's a wonderful idea. Let's see how George handles it. George is sure to pull it off. Remember how George jumped into a cave with a bunch of zombies and skeletons and dealt with all of them in a couple of seconds with a wooden axe and a shield? George has a talent for playing games. Oh yeah. I remember it perfectly, and after George defeated everyone and came to our house, he was accidentally blown up by a creeper right outside the house. I haven't laughed like that in a long time, I don't forget. <laughs> you never know what George will do. He can easily handle a horde of zombies, or he can accidentally fall from a height clumsily jumped. But not just fall but fell right into a single block of water, which I've stopped counting as George's skillful handling of problems. George is a genius. <laughs> it's about time I started thinking about how and where I'm going to build my house. Maybe somewhere here by the sea? It is beautiful here, and there is a forest where I can cut a lot of wood to build a house. I've already found a place to build a house, right on the spawn. I like it here. It's got everything I need. Wood, water, the natural beauty of the cubes. I'll start building slowly. Already? I'm just getting my place ready. Great, then I'll start building sooner. I still don't have enough wood. I need to get as much as I can as soon as possible. I made myself so much soup that half my inventory was filled with soup bowls. Haha, <laughs> well there's plenty of space for a tree. I can just see Peppa with pockets full of soup bowls. Ha ha ha, eat up Peppa, you're still growing up. Ha 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 ha. It's true, you have to eat a lot and eat good. I had a very tasty dinner tonight, thanks, Mummy. So I'm going to start building my house out of wood. A regular little cozy house for me. How's George doing? Any success building a house out of stone? Just a second, let me take a look. <laughs> George has already melted down a lot of stone and made bricks out of them, and is building his house out of them. That's cool. Wow, George, you're a big one, like me. <laughs> Not bad, but making a big house out of stone would be difficult. You'd have to melt a lot of stone and it doesn't melt very fast. George made himself four furnaces, so that sped up the process. But yeah, it takes a long time to melt the stone. Daddy, Mummy, how's the build going so far? What I have left to do in the house is to build the roof and put in the windows. The house is small by my standards, but it's enough for me. Right now, I'm melting sand for glass, and will be building a ladder roof at the same time. I've stocked up on plenty of wood for that, so the only thing left is to put the blocks up nicely. Wow, you are so fast! You've been building and making your own tools very quickly lately already. I'm so glad you're progressing in Minecraft. Back in the day, Mummy and I used to spend many hours playing consoles. We've been playing games for a long time. Experience can't be wasted. Oh yeah, I used to love going over to Daddy's parents' house to play. It was fun. Oh really? That's so cool. My parents are the best. I wish everyone had parents like that. <laughs> and so, I've built myself a roof. I've got the windows and the door. Time to wrap up our adventure for today. 
We've been playing for quite some time. I see George getting sleepy. I'm getting a little sleepy too. Okay, Papa. Come on. I'll tell you a bedtime story. Yay! Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel and like. Also, don't forget to write a comment what you think about our adventures. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye. Bye, kids. <laughs> Hi everyone, today we are going to play Minecraft with my family. <laughs> I also like to play Minecraft. Oh look, Mummy and Puppy. They are probably looking for us. Let's go to them. Hi, kids. Hello, cats. We're finally going to play Minecraft. Yes, it's great. I can't wait. Let's explore this amazing game. Sunset. We need to find beds now. Good idea, puppy. Let's go. Children, I made beds for you. Wow. <laughs> it's time for bed, little cats. Am I my way to bed, mommy? We survived the first night. Let's build boats and sail to the other island. We need wood for boats. Let's chop wood. The island is deserted. Hopefully we will get to a safe place. We need to find food in a cave. Let's go. We found the cave. Don't go any farther, George. It'll help you come to me. Stretch, George, stretch. Well done, George. We found a cave, we could take a little break. Make myself some tools and get some stone. Well, Daddy, you found the idol. Yeah, found some. I'm going to go find food. Mommy, where are you? <laughs> Good wretch. They all struck Where they are, they'll figure it out. Daddy, they're coming for me. Brother, we'll save us. Thank you, Dad. We found the village. There's food in the village. Let's eat now. You ate it. It's time to make a home. This place will be good for us. Yeah, it's a great place. I want to build a house, so with George. Tight. That's the house we got. Well, not bad. Peppa and George, you did a great job. See what's inside. It took me a long time to plan the interior and I didn't know where to put this bed. George helped me. Let's go look at her. Okay. What a huge house.
Pep, can you help? We need to build a ladder to the second floor. You, you either forgot to place it. Okay. Finest. Thank you, Peppa. We need obsidian for the portal to help. Let's go! We could use the other hole. Church found diamonds for the Picasso. Where? Now we can find them, City. Steal the wire, he'll get it. The portal is ready. We can go to help. <laughs> Let's get out of here. We found all the sticks. way to go. And I'll be a great day. Welcome to the world of Minecraft. Here we will meet Peppa, George, and their funny parents. Hi, Peppa. Hi, George. What do you want to do today? I want to build a house today where we can all live together. <laughs> all right, guys, let's start making a world. Let's rename the name of our world the Big Family. And I suggest changing the difficulty mode to high because it will be much more interesting to survive. Peppa's a good idea. It's really more fun that way. <laughs> <laughs> Parents, where are you? I'm somewhere in the woods. Let's get resources for our house. Mom, you start building the house. Well, I'll start building a house in the meantime. <laughs> so, I'm gonna start getting wood, and what are you gonna do, Dad? Peppa, I'm getting wood, too, and what's our favorite George doing? <laughs> George, are you okay? What are you doing? <laughs> Mom, how are you doing? Have you started building our house yet? Peppa, I've already started building a house, and you guys get wood, stone, and food. Okay, Mom, I'll get the wood, then I'll make my own tools. Me too. <laughs> you guys are doing a good job. Keep it up. I'm so glad we're all here to play again. It's so much fun and exciting. Peppa, I'm very happy too. Kids, I'm so glad we can spend time together in Minecraft, by the way. 
Do you like playing this game? Would you like to try playing Roblox? I think it's not a bad idea. There's a lot of different modes and we'll find something for us. I would also play Roblox. There is my favorite mode of Aid, by the way. Not long ago, I saw how Sonic Tails Raider Skate played Evade. I really liked their video. I suggest you watch if you have not seen it. <laughs> so I've already made a workbench. Now I'm going to make an axe and get wood faster. How's it going, Daddy? I also made a workbench, but I will first get a stone to make my own stone tools. How are you guys doing? What are you doing? I'm building a house. Let's hurry up and get the materials. <laughs> Mommy, we're getting supplies for the house as best we can. How's the house going? Peppa, I'm building the house slowly. I hope I can finish it by nightfall, or the hostile creatures will attack us. Mom, don't worry. You'll have the house finished by nightfall, but if you don't, I'll protect you. I have no doubt you'll protect us. We're behind you like a stone wall, but I'd still like to finish the house by nightfall. <laughs> I'm still getting firewood. How much firewood do I need? Honestly, I'm just tired of getting firewood. Peppa, we need a lot of firewood. The house won't build itself. Mom, that's right, Peppa. Don't be lazy and get as much wood as you can. Okay, Dad, I'll get the wood as fast as I can. By the way, how's everybody doing? I'm stable. I'm building a house for us to sleep in and put resources in chess. I think we can also put beds to grow food, but that's for later. Mama Pig, that's a very good idea because the beds are food on a regular basis. And I'm doing well. I'm off to find a stone for stone tools. This is very good because with stone tools you will extract resources much faster than with wooden tools. Peppa, what are you doing right now? I made a wooden pickaxe. Now I will get a stone and make stone tools. By the way, do not forget to get food. I didn't forget, Peppa. I'm on my way to the mine to get food. By the way, Peppa, that's good about the food because there's four of us. We need a lot of food. <laughs> I finally found a stone. Now I'm gonna get it and scrap some stone tools. Yay, Peppa, now you will mine resources twice as fast. How is our daddy? Has he already made stone tools? Mama Pig, I'm still getting food, so we'll always be fed. I'm taking care of you. Peppa, did you make your stone tools yet? I'm almost done crafting stone tools, but there's still coal here. Now I'll get the stone, and then I'll craft a stone pickaxe and get the coal. How's it going, Mama Pig? Did you finish the house yet? I'm finishing the floor now, and then I'll start building the walls. The house will be ready soon. Don't worry. Mom, hurry up and finish the house. George and I can't wait to see it. We're sure it's going to be big and beautiful. <laughs> yes, Mama Pig. The kids are right. You need to hurry up with the house construction. It will be getting dark pretty soon, and we don't have a shelter yet. Yeah, Mommy, Daddy's right. It's going to be dark soon. George and I need a place to sleep. Family, don't worry. I'll have the house finished by tonight. I'm sure of it. Okay, Mama Pig, we're really hoping for you. Yeah, Mom, we believe in you. We know you won't let us down. Thank you, family, for your support. I love you so much. By the way, what are you doing now? Are you doing okay? I'm doing well. I've got enough food. The cow led me into a cave. It's good for me. I'll get a stone here. <laughs> Daddy, you must be lucky. Here I am, finally scraping my stone pickaxe. Now I'm going to get coal and stone, and then I'm going to scrape a stone axe to get as much wood as possible. Ah ha ha ha, thanks Peppa. By the way, it's a good idea. Good luck. Yes, Peppa. It's a really good idea. We believe in you, so keep it up. Thank you, my favorite parents. I love you very much, by the way, what you do. Well, I've already finished the floor. I just have to build the walls, the roof, and put the beds with the chests. And how is our daddy pig? Thank you for asking, my beloved family. I got myself three stones. Now I will scrub up my stone picker and I will continue to extract stone. Daddy, this is a really good idea, but what are you going to do after you get the stone? Peppa, I think I'll put the stove on and fry the meat because I'm hungry. <laughs> Daddy's pig, you're always just eating a ha ha. A ha 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 ha, mom. You're right as always. Daddy really loves to eat. So come on, I don't like this conversation. Better tell me what you're doing. At the moment, I'm mining coal. Now I'll take the workbench and go extract sand for glass. Peppa's a good idea. We could use some glass for our house, and I've just started building walls in our pretty little house. Daddy, what are you doing? I'm getting the stone for the stove in the house, so what else can I do? Well, Daddy Pig, keep digging for the stone we'll really need. Mom, how are you doing? How's our house? Peppa, I'm doing great, but I'm not tired of building a house. Now I'm building a doorway. And how are you and George doing? I'm fine, too. Now I'm looking for a sandy beach. George, how are you? It's been a while since I've heard from you. <laughs> Here comes the voice of our beloved son. And I finally scrambled the stove to fry the meat. I'm so glad. Good, Daddy. I'm happy for you. And I think I see the sand. Good, Peppa. Start digging for sand. It will be very useful to us. I did not doubt you. Thanks, Mommy. I'm gonna go get some sand, Dad. What are you doing? 
I put the stove on and I'm about to fry the chicken and I think it's gonna be really good, don't you think? Ah ha 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 ha, Daddy, of course it'll taste good. You made it. Peppa, you're right. Dad's food is always delicious and I'm almost done building walls. Only left to put glass. How's it going with the pepper sand? Mommy, I'm gonna get a little bit of stone to fry the meat and scrape the rock shovel. And then I'm gonna start digging for sand, okay? All right, well, I'll start putting up the windows. The house is almost finished. How's Daddy and George doing? <laughs> I scrambled a stone sword to protect myself from a hostile mob, and I finally prepared meat. I'm very glad. Good daddy, you're doing great. Keep it up, we're doing great, and mom's doing great. She's been building this house all day by herself. Thanks, Peppa. Very nice to hear. You're all very well, too. Thank you all. Family, it's almost the end of the series. We'll have to say goodbye soon. Say goodbye so fast? I haven't even built a house yet. I don't want to say goodbye. I want to play with my family again. Don't worry, Mom. We'll wait for you to finish the house. We really want to see it. <laughs> George seems to have found a rabbit, George. Be careful with it, see if it bites you. Oh my god, it's so cute. This is really very nice, Daddy. Mom, how are things with our house? You still have a long time? I really want to see it. Peppa, I'm going as fast as I can. There's just a little bit left and the house will be ready. So family, let's say goodbye to the audience. Friends, thank you all for watching. We are very pleased that you are watching our videos to the very end. Do not forget to leave comments. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Bye, everybody. Hi, everyone. Today, me and my brother George are going to play the wonderful game of Minecraft. <laughs> I really love playing Minecraft. I hope you enjoy watching me play it. <laughs> well, it's time to get started. Be what? Beginning my adventure. I need a tree to start with to make tools. The first tree will help me make a wooden pickaxe, which is needed to get the stone. I make stone tools, they are much better than wooden ones. Done! Next to the rainforest, and what do I see? Watermelons? I really like watermelons, they are so delicious. Even though in Minecraft not that they are the best food. That's a lot of white tunnel, I lost if I eat them all at once. <laughs> well, I found Bambi. It could be used to make you a scaffolding that can help me build my house. Bambi came! I spit on so scary. Get this! Floated. It's time to get out of here. There's nothing to do with no resources. The way you oh no. Thank you, thank you. I'm lucky I found the village. Hopefully I'll find something interesting. Keep fishies. Sorry, I need a bed. Hey, big guy. I need you, iron. Thank you. I found another cave. There should be ores in here. And here they are. This is great. What a deep and beautiful cave. I think I'll find everything I need here. I need to sleep here to wait out the night and make a respawn point in case I die here. It's done. I 
found a melted down some iron. Just don't make an iron tool so I can get to the stone if possible. I also made myself a shield to help fend off the arrows of pesky skeletons. I got some more iron and I'm gonna make armor for protection. That's perfect. Going down the way to there should be diamonds here. The most useful thing of all. And here they are, but it seems I'm out of luck, they won't be many. I'll need the lapis lazuli for enchantments. They are spiders near me. There's a whole spot here, but they are not ordinary spiders. And a very dangerous one with venom. I need to be careful with them. Need a sword to quickly break the web and destroy the spawn. But where are the spiders? Why aren't there any? I can handle that one in a time. <laughs> Why, Golden Apple? Pity it's simple. I am on the four horse at the same time. Not much use, Golden Apple. Rock crystals. The wagon with the chest. Got the two diamonds I needed. Now I can make a pickaxe. How lucky I am to spawn this, this time, skeleton spawner. Well, I prepared and sprouted a shield with it. I'm really very easy with them to deal. And they can handle each other without me. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Easy! Nothing useful. What's under there? Light it up with the blueberries I found in the chest. It's time to get out. Found everything I need. I need to find a nice place for my house. I think I'll find it too clean. If I clean this place up a little bit, it'll be just wonderful. Done! I'll just put the stuff I don't need in the chest for now.
this is what the house looks like. It was a cute little house, not small and not big, just right for me. Thanks a lot for watching, subscribe and like, bye bye everyone.